Okay, so we were talking about true love and forever, like the whole journey of doing, of being together and sharing your life. So why do you think people divorce? Like, what do you think that's about? Like, oh, well, I, I feel like... People divorcing and breaking up. You know, they felt it. They felt the passion. They felt the connection and the excitement in the beginning. And then... So and then they want to tear each other's faces off. Like, what is that? Like, oh. when it comes to love, uh, it's something. It's something that you work on every single day, right? There's a reason why my girl loves me, and there's a reason why I love my girl. And if you choose to not love me back continuously, or do the things that you do continuously to maintain that love then I believe that love will fade away, right? And so for some people, I mean, that could be the case, but uh, for other cases, there's money involved, right? Some people divorce because of money. Some people divorce because, you know, they're just not in love no more. They found somebody else. So there's so many reasons for divorce and as to, and also as to why uh, people, you know, just fall out of love. And I, hard, uh, love is a lot of hard work. Mm -hmm. But it's one hundred percent worth it because mm -hmm. it's that special, right? So yeah. Oh, and how about um, what do you think of some like? Okay, some people say that they believe in love at first first sight. What do you think about that? Like, has it? Do you think it happened to you or? I I, I don't believe in love at first sight. I believe it's something that you really got to work on. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. When did you know, when, uh, during your relationship, um, when did you know, when was that time that you knew she's the one, you know, I'm feeling, I'm feeling uh, that this is, this is um, serious? I mean, you don't, I, I believe you don't know, it's like, the, the, the timing is what's most important, because with me and my girl, we knew each other for like seven years, we've only been dating for five uh, but seven years. We've known each other for more than seven years, right? But we've been dating for five years. Mm -hmm. uh, in between the times we haven't been dating, mm -hmm. so like the first three years, we would be on and off. So I talk to her, we talk to each other, try to work it out. It wouldn't work out for whatever the reason is. Then we try it again, and then we just go off and on in different seasons, right? Mm -hmm. And then finally, we just reconnected somehow by chance, like. She just saw me passed out on the couch one day because she was, I had a roommate and her roommate was her friend and she happened to, my roommate happened to bring her over one day and I was just passed out on the couch and I saw her and I was like, what, is that Christiane? And then uh, from there we, we started talking again and that, that's, we were in different places mm -hmm. in our lives compared to when we first met. So we were more mature, we, yeah. we knew what we wanted in life, it's, it wasn't about partying anymore. And we connected in that level, so timing is like everything when it comes to uh, uh, being with, with a special person. Yeah, yeah. Timing is key. Mm -hmm.